Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge and Camilla, the Duchess of Cornwall both married into the royal family and will at some point receive the title of Queen of England. But the two reportedly did not use to get along, here's the Duchess's secret war. Kate Middleton married into the royal family in 2011 as she said I do, to Prince William during a lavish ceremony at Westminster Abbey. Some six years earlier, Camilla Parker Bowles tied the knot with Prince Charles in a civil ceremony at Windsor Guildhall, on April 9, 2005. Both Camilla and Kate are spouses of future kings of England and only became a part of the royal family as they married their significant others. But it appears Camilla used to believe she fits in better among the royals. Christopher Anderson, author of Game of Crowns, published in 2016, revealed Camilla thought Kate was too common to be a part of the family. In his compelling book, Mr. Anderson explored the dynamic and rivalry between Queen Elizabeth II, Camilla, the Duchess of Cornwall and Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge. In a bold claim, the author said Camilla attempted to drive a wedge between Kate and her husband Prince William. Camilla reportedly encouraged Prince Charles to urge his son to break off the relationship. Mr. Anderson told the Daily Beast, I've been covering the royal family for 40 years. I have people telling me information about what's going on behind the scenes some on the record, some not and I've always protected them and they've been wonderful. Kate and William briefly split up in April 2007, before getting back together a couple of months later. Mr. Anderson said, I was in London when the breakup of William and Kate occurred. I was shocked, completely stunned, everyone thought it was only a matter of time before William was going to ask Kate to marry him. And then people started telling me that Camilla was behind it. To understand why Camilla would encourage the breakup, Mr. Anderson said Camilla is a bit of a snob. He continued, she's an aristocrat, she has always been moving in royal circles. She had always thought of herself as the heiress to Alice Keppel, her great-grandmother, who was the mistress of Edward VII. She was very proud of that connection, she boasted about that as a child and as an adult and that's what she intended to be. Part of the royal circle in the role of mistress to the future king, and then the king. She did not look at Kate as someone who was worthy of joining the royal family. Kate is the first working-class woman to be accepted into the royal family. She is descended from coal miners and her mother was a flight attendant. So for all those reasons Camilla never really felt that Kate Middleton as an individual and the Middleton family as a whole were going to be worthy of entering into the royal family. I was told at the time of the breakup, and later on as well, that Camilla basically whispered in Charles's ear that it was really time to make to force William to make a decision one way or the other.